If you're driving in Menominee County, you might have find a few paved roads now have loose gravel covering them. That's because the County Road Commission started a chip sealing pilot program today. TV6's Escanaba Bureau reporter Barbara Bellinger asks the county engineer how chip sealing will benefit the budget and roads. Menominee County has a new approach to chip sealing this year. The pilot program is addressing some of the primary routes, uh, different traffic levels, like I said, different condition, um, different pavement types, things like that, just to try the program out and see how effective chip sealing really is. Cass says chip sealing roads in fair condition or above has been highly effective for the county. He says the process increases road longevity by seven to 10 years. The county now wants to see if chip sealing is effective for roads in poor condition. Cass says 60% of the county's more than 1,000 miles of roads are rated poor. The goal is to get to 60 to 70% of roads rated good or fair. Previously, roads in poor condition would be resurfaced with new asphalt, but Cass says asphalt resurfacing costs four times as much. We're hoping that this program by preserving the roads, sealing the road beds, extends the life of the, the current roads we have now, and we can keep improving more and more roads each year. The county is chip sealing 15 miles of roads in poor condition this summer. We do anticipate to ramp this program up and hopefully do 30 to 50 miles per year. Cass asks drivers to use caution when entering freshly chip sealed roads due to loose gravel. Barbara Bellinger, TV6 News, Menominee County. For the first time, the Road Commission has a millage on the November 5th ballot. If it passes, the commission would get an extra $1.1 million for road improvements.